you want to talk me through the uh, what exactly is happening now? Right here. Yeah. Uh, right now, the churn's running at low speed. We're at the, the final uh, ending of the churning process. What we're waiting for is the curd to get to be about the size of a quarter. And every once in a while, Jay will periodically stop and we'll check in the small inspection door to see what size the curd's at. And when it gets to the right size, then we'll drain the buttermilk off onto the pan yeah. the floor here and it gets pumped over into the stainless steel uh, refrigerated tank for the temporary storage. And this building that we're in, what's the, the history of the building? The building was built in 1920. Um, it was always a creamery. They always made butter here. Uh, there never been other products made. It started out as being a raw milk plant and then it went to a cream only plant and back to a raw milk plant. So that's the history of it. Upstairs there's a dance hall. <laughs> show you that. Oh, wow. Uh, but at the time it was built, it was kind of a community hall. You want to look in there, Jake, can you look in there? You can see the curd is starting to clump up. Oh, okay. yeah. We're looking for it to get to be about 50 cent piece, quarter, and that size. Mm -hmm. And then at that point in time, we'll drain the buttermilk off. And the buttermilk is the, you can see it dripping around the door edge there. That's the, uh, yeah. it comes out like a, like a skim milk. It kind of comes out. Doesn't that smell good? Mmm. <laughs> And then, how big did you say this can, how much butter can this produce? We typically you? make a 2,500 pound batch. Mm -hmm. this, this churn will hold up to 900 gallons. 